Harvey Hosin helped Derbyshire to a respectable first innings total against Leicestershire on day one. Derbyshire was sent in to bat first and Slater found the boundary early on. Godelman went for nine though, LBW to Mackay. Spin was introduced early in the innings but Slater was equal to the challenge. After a promising start, Slater fell for 27 off 36 balls, chipping Shrek's first delivery to Patini at cover. New batsman Hughes cut Dexter to the fence and Madsen got off the mark against Shrek. Madsen cut Dexter for four, but both batsmen had to survive a fine spell from Shrek before lunch. They managed to do so, Hughes and Madsen guiding Derbyshire to 78 for two at lunch. After the break, Madsen started the afternoon with a well-timed straight drive. Hughes and Madsen continued to build, Madsen using the reverse sweep to good effect. With the third wicket partnership worth 84, Leicestershire had a breakthrough, Madsen caught behind off Jones for 38. Hughes passed his 50, but not long afterwards fell to Shrek for 55, Eckersley with the catch. Broom clipped Shrek off his legs for a six, but it was to be six and out when Broom went for a runnable 15. Wickets in successive overs for Shrek, Robson with the grab. Hosin lost another partner when Wood was bowled by Dexter for eight. Milnes was out to Sayer for 19 when reverse sweeping, Eckersley the catcher, the batsman waiting for the umpire's finger. Palladino joined Hosin and the pair added 38 at a runner ball to secure a second batting point, Hosin reaching his half century. Palladino was to go for 12, caught Eckersley, bowled Dexter. The new ball was taken and Mackay initially struggled to make the most of it, sending down five wides that went through the slip cordon. However, the Australian showed more control to find Hosin's edge, but the chance went down at second slip. The end of play came early due to bad light, Hosin 79 not out, new man Parkinson unbeaten on six, Derbyshire 282 for eight in their first innings at the close on day one.